RPG 12 The challenge is really we're a way of allowing the player to come outside of the main fiction and just have fun being Harry in lots of different scenarios. It's basically the spell combat from the, the main game boiled down to its purest form. <laughs> Uh, my favourite challenge is the survival in the quarry. It's fast, it's frantic, it's hard, and really makes you use all your spells to full effect. It's kind of one of the most rewarding because you use so much of what you've learned through playing the game. Sometimes standing back and using cover and taking out the enemy as they come to you is actually the quickest way of dispatching them. Certain pieces of cover in the game can only take so much damage before they fall away, leaving you exposed. So it's really important that you plan where you're going to move next once this cover's disappeared. It's very easy to run straight in and get overwhelmed by them coming at you from all sides. Bad guys have got different scores attached to them, so the more powerful spell they use usually means they're worth more points. So snatches that use um, Impedimentia will be worth more than Snatches using Stupefy, and Death Eaters are worth more than Snatches. The quicker you defeat your enemy, the higher the score you'll attain for that. So consider targeting their head, um, because that's the quickest way that actually you can defeat them. The key thing for getting a great score on any of these challenges is about choosing the right spell for the right moments. Expelliarmus is a great spell for using if you're caught in the open because it can dispatch enemies very quickly. Expelliarmus is the most accurate spell, and so as you're running between the rocks, you always want to be charging it so that when you catch sight of an enemy between the rocks, you can let go with one shot and try and take them out. It's quite good at long range against slow moving targets, but it's relatively easy to dodge, so you need to be sure that you're going to hit the target when you let, let it go. When you've got a Death Eater or Snatcher in a medium to short range area, I like to use Expel So, because every one of your shots, if it hits, it's going to do a large amount of damage. The trouble is, when you're in an open environment, the Snatchers can move around a lot, the result being that many of your shots could end up missing. By using Confundo, you can turn the most powerful enemies to your side and get them to fight the battle for you. You're able to go online compare how well you've done at the challenges with your friends and also compare how well you've done compared to everybody else in the whole world. In addition to online leaderboards, we also have local leaderboards and these record the top 10 scores on your console. So if you want to invite some friends around, you can literally duke it out and find out who is the best wizard of all.